Are you looking for that perfect gift for that entrepreneur in your life? Help them get started. Or are you a budding entrepreneur and you want to start creating some content? I'm going to show you some budget-friendly items that I already use to create content here on YouTube for social media, just about anywhere. So let's get started. Let's go. So this is part of my mobile kit. I have used several tripods, but this is my favorite. This is the Yukos uh, tripod. So it has a tilt head, which I like a lot. Except I can't tilt it. There you go. Tilting head. Has a firm stand. It's tall. I'm kind of tall, so I needed a taller one. This one is nice and tall. And it also comes with a Bluetooth button to start, stop and start your phone, which is really handy. I really like this tripod because I can use it as a selfie stick or expand it all the way up and use it to record content on my phone. I use two different items to hold my phone. This one is when I'm really serious, okay? So this is the newer, and I can hold this or I can mount it on a tripod, and what this does is it keeps things more steady. And I can put my phone right in here. It's a spring clamp. And then it has lots of shoe mounts, cold shoe mounts, and so I can mount my Ulanzi light. This Ulanzi light is great. It's a rechargeable. I keep it in my mobile kit. And so it gets a nice bright light and you can change how bright that light is. Great for doing selfies and on the go videos. That's the Ulanzi VL49 and I'll have links in the description below. And then the newer mount that you can put your phone in, in either direction. Um, you can mount that on a tripod in multiple places. So it's very versatile. I really like this a lot. For microphones for my phone or when I'm doing a presentation I'm going to be walking around, I want something wireless and I use the Ulanzi mics, budget friendly. You can get them for either USB-C or you can get them with a iPhone connector. You put that in your phone and then you have two mics that you can hook up to two different people so you can do interviews with these. I love these because if I need to do a podcast or something on the go, I'm ready to go. And I can just use it for my short form content and my long form content. It has a great sound. I just clip it on my shirt and I'm ready to go. You'll see these in some of my videos. The case is rechargeable and then that recharges the devices Ulanzi wireless mics, link in the description below. I also like this holder. If I don't want the larger phone holder for my tripod, I use this holder. I'll have this linked in the description below. This phone holder is great because it's adjustable with a clamp, so it's not um, spring-loaded, which makes it a little easier and holds um, often a little tighter. It's more adjustable for the type of phone you're using. I also like it because the head can swivel and so I like to use this on a tripod and I keep all this. This is my uh, Yukos tripod holder. I slide this in there and my wireless mics and my tripod. So if I know I'm going out and I might want to do some short form content with my phone, I just have to grab this and I'm ready to go. That's my mobile setup. So this is my mobile setup. It works great and I can record video on the go. And we can do a tour of the studio with this setup that I just described. So works great. Got all the light I need and we're ready to go. So let's do it. So let's do a quick tour of my studio setup. Here we are in the Future Ready Consulting recording studio. I use a Scepter monitor which is from Amazon. An expensive monitor, just to give me a second monitor to work off of. Sometimes I do use a teleprompter, so that is my teleprompter system. 
little prompter. I have an extra light here because I get great light from this window over here, but this light adds to it, which is fantastic. The camera I like to use is the Anchor Power Conference Camera. It adds a little extra touch to the conferencing system, which I really appreciate. It makes it a lot crisper, cleaner, um, but that's what you do if you can't afford a camera right now and get a really nice conferencing camera and that produces pretty nice looking videos for you. And then for my microphone setup, I use the toner microphone with the pop filter and then the screen behind it, the toner screen behind it, that helps keep from the echoing of the sound, makes it a little richer and just kind of uh, makes the whole sound a lot cleaner. And I keep my notes over here on the Super Note. If you haven't checked out Super Note, they're, they're a little pricey, but they're great to keep written notes on. And that's what I keep my written notes on. So those are just um, a few of the products that I like to use. That's just a few of the products that I like to use for my personal setup. It's kind of a budget setup, but it works great for starting entrepreneurs, and then you can build upon it later. Don't make your equipment the reason that you're not getting out there and producing videos right now. Go ahead and check out some of these items and see if you can get started on your content creation for 2024, or if you do an entrepreneur that really has some great ideas and needs to get started, why don't you give them a boost, give them a gift of equipment that they can start their business and their content creation journey. All you need is a phone. A couple of these devices will upgrade you just a little bit and get started today. If all you have is a phone, use your phone. You can always add to it later. All right, I'm Janet with Future Ready Consulting. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe or check out another one of our videos. And remember, without impact, it doesn't matter. Take care.